the water. Newth's Lake here. This is beautiful. This is a little section that I always go to that takes us up to another cliff. And as you can see, they built these steps to get over to this area over here. And it is totally underwater. I think um, the steps here, we see uh, about three, four steps, and then the water appears. And you see the steps in the water there. But this is totally flooded out. That right there is where I gotta get to. So I'm gonna take the uh, trail on around and do it that way. Let's see, there are signs that are posted. And here we see the river is way up. Way up. Let's see, the river is in the woods. Here it's coming up to the lake. lake through there. It's a gorgeous day. Here's the lake. I finally got over to where I wanted to get to. And you can see that's just all water there. And here's the one stream that feeds into this. And there's a trail right there. But uh, I can't even get over there because uh, the water's just too high. It backed up from the river. And I'm going to pan on around here just to give you an idea. This is all inundated by the river. There's all the water backed up from the Noose River. And you can see how high it comes up. This is a relatively flat trail. And it's only down about maybe four feet from this trail here. This is really amazing. This is a tree. It's growing from there. And it forms an arch. And you can see, then all of a sudden, it shoots up, and there it is. Very interesting. This is, this is a section of the trail that was roped off. And right here is once where a gigantic oak tree stood and it was partially hanging over the river and that hurricane that we had uh, finally uh, the tree fell over and here it is there's part of it the river is up so high this tr this is a gigantic hundred plus year old tree and you can just see the top of it and the river is extremely high it's probably down about I would say maybe a good 20 feet and I've seen this though in one storm where it was actually I would say five or five eight feet uh, from the top here 
and Anna and I were here. But there's the river, Noose River, and it is beautiful. And it's very high. I would say probably 20 feet over flood stage. This is one of my favorite trees. My favorite tree right here and look at it. Here we go. And here's a beautiful notch. Actually forms an L and then grows straight up into a beautiful tree. Here we go again, just a beautiful trail. And a beautiful day and if we kind of peer through the woods here, you'll see the lake. And this is the uh, recreational park lake. Coming up to one of the greatest parts of the trail here. This is where there's some really beautiful pine trees. Right around this curve. Yeah, the sun's interfering a little bit here. Maybe I'll catch this on the way back. But here you can see a nice little pine stand. This is beautiful. The water, New Slake here. This is beautiful. Well, it looks like the Looks like the trail ends. Steps lead right into the water. And there's a uh, big pecan tree. And the whole trail is just what? Inundated by water. Yeah, they're going to try to keep me at a bird trail. I don't think so. Watch this. See how easy that was? And I didn't have to destroy anything. But this is a, nat this is a great park. And believe you me, I know what danger is.